It was a pretty intense ball game, and I guess no surprise to see Jorge Alfaro at the end of it once again, huh? Yeah, I think the only surprise is him literally walking, walking off. So not not really one of his things that he tends to do. We've seen him, you know, get a few hits to do it. But, man, after getting down 0-1 like that, having to be trying to be patient, bases loaded, knowing you got to throw it over the plate. Like I said, it's not really his forte, but, you know, he seems to come up big in those at-bats and really focus and – you know, it's got. There's a lot of desire in it. As far as this game went, it seemed like there was a lot of ups and downs, yeah. a lot of roller coasters, there's a lot of things that you wouldn't expect. So, right. but you guys come out on top. This is the 12th time you've won a, a walk-off, 12th time right. in extra innings. What is it about your club that gets it done? Lately? Well, I look. It's 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 a lot of things. One, it's you know success here, doing it, the belief that we're going to do it when we get into that. Our fans are all over it. So, you know, the, all the combination, all of those things really gives us an, an edge and advantage. I think when we get in that situation late in games, we always think we're going to come through. And, you know, our, our, certainly our fans are uh, very inspirational late in games through like that. You know, Pierce Johnson, that was, pretty, that was pretty great. I mean, on his behalf, this isn't a spot he's been in. You know, we we're looking to get him back, get him in a role. Um, that inning, I'm not sure we had targeted him for. But he's pitched so well, and you know he gets righties, lefties out, throws breaking ball for a strike. So th this was his biggest outing, obviously for us, and came at a great time. It almost seems like a different game ago, but Blake, uh, yeah. maybe not as sharp as night, but he, he gutted through it and made pitches when he needed to. Yeah, you know what? One hit, three walks, some foul balls, and after throwing what was it, one fourteen or whatever it was last time, I wasn't going to let him go more than five innings. But again, kept him scoreless. You know. Had six more strikeouts, walked a few guys, maybe not as efficient as last time out, but still, you know, zeros across the board when he came out. I know Blake went out tonight because of the pitch count, but is this maybe the kind of game your bullpen might have to face in the, in the playoffs where you might pull a starter sooner and then they have to cover against a good team? Yeah, I mean, you know, with the way our bullpen's been pitching and we have some depth there now, you know, different looks against good teams. You know, against a team like this, you don't want to give them too many looks against uh, one particular pitcher. But we also have some starters that we feel pretty good about, too. So there will be a balance to it. But you do see, you know, if indeed it goes farther than, you know, the end of the season here, that bullpens become a major factor. Yeah, it felt great. Just uh, tough to get, you know, the command with the fastball off speed was good. Uh, but I'm not looking too, too much into it. Happy with how I competed. Uh, threw up five innings scoreless, so got to be happy with that. I'll clean up the, you know, the fastball not being in the zone, but fastball's coming out good. Off speed feels great. Uh, change up looked really good today. Um, Ooh, change, did you say change up? <laughs> it's nasty. It is nasty. Um, so, yeah, I mean, I'll work on, you know, getting the fastball back in the zone. I just think that was... I just, for whatever reason, couldn't feel it today, but I'm very confident in it. I think well, I know by the next outing, uh, it'll be in the zone and I'll be dominating with it. So, um, not too worried about that. Happy with the off speed, happy with how I battled. So, on to the next and focus on that. Yeah, do you, do you take the results for what they are? Like five scores? Anybody... Yeah, because I competed with, uh, you know, not being in the zone as much as I would have liked to be. Uh, I, I, I want to look at, at how many times I got ahead 0-2 and then went to 3-2. It was a good amount. Uh, at least I felt that way. So, I gotta watch, learn, and then uh, I'll make the adjustments needed. But yeah, just a weird, just kind of a weird game with the way the fastball felt so great. It was coming out so good. I was trying to throw it. I mean, there was moments where I was trying to throw it directly down the middle. I felt that confident with it. So it's frustrating, but I know I'll, by the next start, I'll be hitting my spots and right where I need to be. I know you worked with Jorge a decent amount this season. Mm -hmm. For him to have five, like walk-off play appearances this season. How do you put how do you put that in the context? What what is it about him? Uh, I mean, I, I think he enjoys those big moments, and I think he enjoys how much his teammates want to hear him say. Uh, say what? Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> and I heard Mud. He better have got his fifth. <laughs> I heard that Mud. <laughs> What's the confidence level when he's up there in that situation at this point? Uh, I mean, we all know it's going to happen. I think he knows, we all know, so that's really exciting. Especially uh, bases loaded, he's coming up, we know something's going to happen. So it's definitely something that we all look forward to. Did tonight feel like a playoff vibe, a playoff vibe to it? Uh, 
Towards the end, maybe. I wasn't out there. Uh, and when I'm pitching, I don't have a clue. So I can't hear anything. So, yeah, I can't. Um, so, yeah, I have no clue. How important is it for you guys to, like, some other teams around you, Santa's are faltering a little bit, but how important is it to just go out there and seize it? And kind of not worry yeah, about we just got to win every game. And we're playing, I mean, we're playing really good baseball. Uh, you know, like, we'll make an error here and there, but we pick each other up and we stay in the game, and that's that's huge. So I think we're, we're going to start, I think we're hitting our, our stride, and I think we're going to turn the corner here. So I'm really excited about that.